the the art is this beast it's this machine that you get on and and it's relentless and it's challenging and and it's a roller coaster ride and you kind of got to you've got to have thick skin you know mm. in order to be able to go through it and you know you don't often feel as though you really have a say you don't often feel as though you really have a voice you're saying yes to every gig that comes along you're saying yes to what the show expects of you you're saying yes to the demands and yes to the gruel and yes to the sacrifices because mm. it's a competitive industry you want to stay in it for as long as you possibly can and you feel as though saying no um comes at a consequence um like losing your job or 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 getting a reputation where you are difficult to work with so you end up saying you end up being a yes man and you say yes to a lot of things that you would normally say no to uh and so i i feel as though um in this role that i have now and this job that i have now in the sector that i work in now i have a voice um you know i am seen and i am heard and i have um the right to choose and so when it gets too much i can say stop or i can press pause and i can look after myself and then i can step back in when i'm ready <laughs> It, well, what does it take for someone to make it in the performing arts? Like, well, what are people looking for? Teamwork, collaboration, adaptability, resilience, grit, courage, perseverance, um, persistence. Like, there are so many values that are required for you to have a career as a performer. Mm. Um, there are so many sacrifices as well like you've really got to prioritize this job you know i've missed out on births and funerals and weddings and um celebrations and you know i've missed out on travel i've missed out on holidays like i've missed out on so much um because i had to be available um you know to to this machine and you know it 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 takes a lot it takes a lot of commitment um mm. to be to be in the creative industries um so yeah it's it's not an easy gig um you know and it can sometimes come at a cost if you don't know how to look after yourself while you're doing it there's a big difference between art and industry mm -hmm. so art carries a sense of creative freedom self-designed work you know um the ability to choose what you want to do and what you don't want to do um you know that's art and i think that's why we go into the industry because we love our art we love our passion we love to sing dance act create mm -hmm. but industry is a very very different thing industry is about showing up industry is about doing the job executing the job responsibilities um you know the 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 pressure um you know the duty so industry and art are very very different and you know like you, you look at people like lady gaga and you look at people you know like like actors um who go industry and and there's a, a you know like britney spears and all of that mm. sort of stuff like the industry requires a lot from you and you're like i said you're on this machine and it feels like you have no control of it because someone else is deciding where you're going to be you know um what you're going to do and for a lot of a lot of artists you notice them a lot of these big artists you notice them they'll, they'll start to divert and they'll go to a place where they choose some different kinds of projects you know yeah. where they have a little bit more power and they have a little bit more say um and and you know because because the industry is consuming it's very consuming um and it is also you are very replaceable very replaceable if you don't want to do it there's someone else who will um someone who will accept less money um because they they're dying for the opportunity um so i think that's why i refer to industry as a machine because industry and art are very very different things